Einstein isn't with you? Mm -mm. I haven't seen him yet today. Speak of the devil, look who's here. <sighs> Hello, everybody. Let me guess, you fell asleep in front of your computer again. Uh, yeah. How'd you know? In the imprint of your keyboards on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> I was up all night working on a program. I came up with an idea for bringing William back. Hey, Ulrich, can I talk to you for a sec? Uh, well, if you really have to, yeah. Go ahead, I'll meet you inside. Well, uh, everybody says that girls really like you a lot. That depends on the girl. Well, like my sister, for example. Uh, beep. Wrong. Try again. Yui and I are good friends, that's all. Yeah, well, maybe that's just what she told you. Mm -hmm. But anyway, I didn't want to talk about Yumi, but about, uh, Millie. Millie who? Millie Solovyev. You know that tall, red-headed girl in seventh grade? Oh, little Millie. Oh, yeah, of course I know her. So? Well, actually, I, I kind of like her, but when I try to talk to her, I can't think of anything to say. Just talk to her about the things she likes, her interests. You know, she's got a passion for journalism. Great idea! Wouldn't it be great if I could find her a scoop? She'd be crazy about me if I did. Uh, yeah, a scoop for the paper, but uh, just what kind of scoop? Oh, you can leave that to me, Ulrich. Hmm. What did Hiroki want to talk to you about? Oh, he wanted my advice. He's crazy about Millie. He is? Now, isn't that cute? But is the guy a little young for her? No, he's not. He's just a little small for his age. And what's more, he skipped a grade in school. But he acts even younger than his age. Hey, Jeremy, tell us about this new idea of yours. Well, OK. Whenever a human being is virtualized, he or she emits a binary residue which we can say manifests itself as an emanation of his physical person, resequenced in a sort of digital format. Yeah, mm -hmm. in English? When you go to Lyoko, you leave a kind of digital trace, something like a scent. Couldn't you have said that in the first place? Mm, no. Anyway, I came up with a program based on William's DNA sequence that I recorded when he went to Lyoko for the first time. If I can upload this onto the skid sonar, we can hunt for him on the network every time we go there and finally find out where William really is. So what you're saying is the skid will become a sniffer sub. That's right, Odd. And since we don't have class this afternoon, I was going to suggest that we try it out. <gasps> Hiroki, what do you think you're doing? <laughs> Hey, give that back to me right now! You sure look far away, Ulrich. It's nothing. Just thinking about something Hiroki said. Oh, yeah? What was that? Uh, nothing. Forget it. <laughs> uh -huh. yeah. No, sorry. Uh -huh. What's wrong? Does this, you want to go out with him or something? <laughs> hey! Yumi, hold on! Whoa! <laughs> Is this yours, Odd? Are you kidding me? A notebook with a dark cover and a flower is not my style. Ha! <laughs> huh? Yeah! Ugh. Give it back right this second, you brat! Oh, come on, sis, I was just kidding! It, look, here it is. Uh, uh, well, it was here. What? Uh, uh, <clears throat> well, you're gonna laugh, but uh, I dropped it, I think. You'd better be kidding. <clears throat> Hey, 
Hey, that's a pretty good shot of you. Who's your secret admirer? Let me see. It's Yumi's, right? It's her diary. That's why she was running after Hiroki. If you ask me, this is a great chance to see what she thinks of you. Oh, no. What's written inside here is not my business. And don't forget that Yumi and I are just good friends, that's all. Are you sure? Well, actually, I'm not sure at all. You look angry. Oh, my stupid brother. He stole a... something important to me and he lost it. Look, Yumi, I, uh, okay, I got it. I upgraded the skid sonar. We're all set. All set for what? Oh, right. You don't know yet. I'll tell you all about it. I, I might have found a way to bring back William. Oh, cool. Uh, Yumi. Yumi! I've been looking for you. I, I wanted to apologize for this morning. I had no right to take your diary. Did you find it? No, but I, I looked everywhere, I swear. Well, until you find it, you can consider yourself an only child. Oof. What happened? Oh, nothing. Some diary straits. We'll tell you about it. Oh, wait, can I see you for a minute? Well, so what do we do now? We go to lunch. So what's the deal? I thought you were going to return the diary. Well, you saw how crushed Hiroki was. If I'm the one who gives the diary back, Yumi will still be angry with him. Yes, yeah, so? So what if we fix it up so that Hiroki finds the diary and gives it to Yumi himself? That's two birds with one stone. She gets her diary back and he gets his sister back. Pretty good idea, huh? Yeah, great. But how do you plan to do it? Hide the diary under a pile of leaves in the park, near the garden shed. I'll take care of Hiroki. Okay. But give me a few minutes. I've got to go get Kiwi first. I forgot to walk him this morning. Deal. I totally messed that up, Warwick. Relax, Hiroki. Yumi will calm down and forgive you, especially when she gets her diary back. I know, but I've looked everywhere for it. I even retraced my steps back to here. Nothing. I don't know what to do. Oh, by the way, this morning I thought I saw Mr. Riley raking up some dead leaves on the park grounds. So what? He's a groundskeeper. That's his job. What if he raked up the diary at the same time? Well, that's dumb. Why would he do that? <laughs> he might have raked it up by accident. <laughs> mm, hey, the diary could be under a bunch of leaves. Let's go check. <laughs> Wait up, Hiroki. Huh? Well, find anything? <laughs> no, nothing. Keep looking. Which one did you put it in? Oh, you'll find it soon enough. You'll see. <laughs> Kiwi, there you are. Where were you, my little diggity dog? Get in! I got it! Huh? <sighs> you mind telling me what you're doing? Uh. <gasps> I'll never forgive you for this, Hiroki. Don't look at me like that. It was all there when I hit it. Get to the scanner room. I'll start up the virtualization process. All set, I'll launch the procedure. For once, it won't be ladies first. Transfer Ulrich. Transfer odd. Scanner Ulrich. Scanner odd. Virtualization. Yumi's in a foul mood. You'd better tell her the truth about her diary. And how do you think she'll react when she finds out that you were the one who hit it? Hey, this was your idea, Casanova. <laughs> ah, 
Let's go. Elevators waiting. Stand by for liftoff. Releasing supports now. Vertical propulsion operational. Liftoff. Ready to dive into the digital sea. Hollow web system connected. Yoko, Jeremy. Rotation. Turbo propeller launched. I'm running the program. Stand by to receive initial coordinates. Roger. Oh no! What's going on? A problem, Princess? We've got a system error. I think this kid has a malfunction in part of its sensory capacity. Yes, I see it, Aelita. It's my program that bugged up the skid's sonar. The mission's too dangerous without sonar. <laughs> Gotta end it now. Roger, returning to dry dock. Okay, next mission, diving into my pillow and burying myself under the covers. Objective, a good night's sleep to clear my head. Sorry, but you're gonna have to postpone your nap, Odd. I've got three congers heading straight for the skid. Nav skid, away! Take this, fish face! Not bad! You make pretty effective when she's mad! Uh, I've got one on my tail! Oh, it's sticking to me like grill! Yeah, bullseye! Nice one, good buddy! Wanna team up for the last one? Yeah, let's do it! Guys, time to come home now. Snaps gets in. Hey, 
Where's Yumi? Huh? I don't get it. I don't have any trace of her. I've lost her. She must have gotten hit by a conger. But that's impossible. Einstein, you think she might have been virtualized for good? No, I... I don't think so. The data recording from the fight doesn't show any sign of her having been eliminated. That means she's still somewhere on board our nav skid, somewhere in the middle of the digital sea. Right, but the skid is in no condition to find her. You guys have to come back in for me to run a repair program. What? No way! We can't just leave her behind. Ulrich, no one's leaving anyone, but all of us run the risk of being virtualized forever with the skid systems down. Yeah, you're right. We better go. Take you to fix it. Reprogramming the sonar is linked to balancing the bipolarity of flux on the one hand. On the other, just tell us when we can go back, okay? Soon, as long as you let me concentrate. Don't worry, Ulrich. I'll help him. I'll call you as soon as we know. Can anybody hear me? This is Yumi. I don't know where I am. Oh, I'm in trouble. Almost out of power. Can you hear me? Answer me. Somebody please answer me! What a nightmare. Relax. You heard Einstein. She hasn't gone from the network. We'll bring Yumi back. Don't worry. <laughs> hey, what have we got there, Kiwi? Ulrich, oh, this is Yumi's diary. What? Hmm, I did it. Kiwi saw me bury it, but he thought it was a game, so I guess he dug it up and buried it here. Right where we're sitting now. That's great. We found her diary, but now we lost Yumi. Jeremy? Aelita? Can you hear me? This is Yumi. I'm almost out of power. It's cold here, and I feel all alone. Okay, you mean you've got only one torpedo left, so don't waste it. Oh no, not enough power. I'm not done yet. If I reduce power in my shield, I should have enough. Yes! Okay, you and me. Fire! An explosion. A Navsky torpedo. Yumi. Yes, Ailita? Huh? Okay, we're on our way. They found Yumi. Odd. Well? I want to go home. Yumi, who am I going to play with if you go away? No, Hiroki. Foot becomes feet in the plural. How do you know all that, sis? <clears throat> oh, what are you children up to this time? <laughs> <laughs> well, how long? Oh, at least ten minutes. Wow! Hiroki, I had no right to take your diary. Until you find it, you can consider yourself an only child. Oh. I'll never forgive you, Hiroki. Yumi sent us a message, guys. Great, we'll go and get her. I have to finish the calculations first. I've isolated the area, but it'll be impossible to find her exact location before I fix the skid sonar. But if she fired a torpedo, that means she's in a jam. I've transposed the data from the explosion into the hollow web to get her position via triangulation. There she is! She must have gotten sucked into a hub. That's why we lost all trace of her. But the sonar is still down, guys. So going under right now is going to be a big risk. Hmm. I'll go. Count me in. Well, what are we all waiting for? <laughs> There's a hub dead ahead. I read you, Alita. I'm entering the coordinates from where Yumi fired her torpedo. 
aspiration into hyperfluid in three seconds. Hang on tight. Where you were? It took you long enough to get here. Now anchor yourself to the skid and head back in. Ah, uh, they're all coming home. Not everybody. But one day, we'll bring you back, William. know just how sorry I am for what I did. Thanks for bringing it back. Huh? Oh. You know, I understand now that what we have is more important than some old diary. I forgive you. Are you in love or what? Oh, get out of here. 